Today I'm going to be showing you how to be making a privacy screen using the Altapen IKEA outdoor floor tiles. Hi, my name is Colette. Let's get started. Okay, so let me guide you on how we're going to do this whole privacy uh, screen situation. If you already have a privacy screen and you just want to fix the middle part, what you're going to do is going to, you're going to have to remove the middle part and leave the frame. If you don't have a frame, uh, check down the description box down below. I have a video uh, where I built one. I'm going to show you in that video. I'm going to show you how you can build uh, your framework. It's super easy. You don't need power tools. You just need a saw, uh, the lumber, and some screws, and you're good to go. You're going to have to remove, like I said, you're going to remove whatever is in the middle. Remove it, and then you attach the tiles. The tiles are super easy to attach because they come with a manual inside the IKEA. A box uh, there's a manual that shows you how to clip the tiles or how to attach uh, to to combine the tiles or to attach them together it's just a clip a press and clip a press and clip so the first tile that you're going to attach to the frame you need to screw it in first in place of where you want it depending on whether you want it low high whatever you're going to attach it using some screws and then the tiles that are following back the first tile you have to click and attach click and attach click and attach until the end for me i use three and a half tiles at the top the last tile on this on on this side i had to cut it and it's not hard to cut you just need a saw but you can also use a wire cutter because at some point i used a wire cutter and then i like you bend it bend it bend it until it breaks and then you attach it so you're going to repeat this whole process top to bottom the box has nine tiles i'm not sure how many i use but to be on the safe side, buy more. If, you're going, if you think you're going to use like two boxes, buy three boxes. Okay, so the next step is attaching it to the rail. It's not the prettiest way of doing it, but that's the only thing I could do. So I use duct ties to attach it to the metal rail. After all, it's a rental, I cannot start welding. So yeah, duct ties. I attach them. Okay, so as you can see, it's actually, it works. The whole hack works. You can't see my neighbor. My neighbor sits there. As you can see the dark figures there. Those are the outdoor chairs. And you can't see them and they can't see us. So it actually works as a private screen. See? It works, guys. It's a good hack. <laughs> if you love this IKEA hack and you want to see more IKEA hacks, please like this video and subscribe for more IKEA hacks.